What's up, it's your boy Beat Up Boy. Welcome back to another video. Hold on, let me put my picky ring on real quick. Hold on, something. Throw's gonna come out, so I gotta put my Finney Stones on this joint, you know. Piggy ring, piggy ring. This is gonna be the story of the time that I got ran up on in Walmart for selling marijuana. So, get your popcorn, get your tea ready, because this is interesting. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Alright, story time. So, I'm in. I'm wearing this. Was I actually wearing this? I think I was wearing this exact hoodie, if not uh, another hoodie in my closet. I'm at Walmart. I'm just getting some chips or whatever for my hair, toothpaste. I don't know what day it was. It was a day I got done playing basketball. And normally, after I get done playing basketball, I'll go to the store to get something to drink or go get something to eat. I think it's one of those days I did neither of them because I think I was needing toothpaste because I hadn't brushed my teeth in like two days. So I just been grabbing on myself with some mouthwash or I could have got some mouthwash. But that's beside the point. Um, My breath does not stink. Don't come for me. I just had really bad sinuses. So you might smell it. Anyways, I'm walking to go check out. My man's ran up to me like this. Hey man, you got the drugs? You got the drugs on you, brother? I'm like, what are you talking about? I know you got the drugs on you. How much you want? I said, bro, I don't sell no marijuana, tobacco, black miles, jewels. I don't sell nothing. He's like, come on, man. I got a five on it right now, man. Come on, let's go, man. Right now. I'm like, bro, all I have is my wallet and my phone and my keys. That's all I have. <laughs> he was like, Alright man, I'll catch you later bro. I said if this I said this man don't get on I'm like I just got ran up on for some And then in my mind I'm like it might be the hood But then again I was really tired And plus I don't know if my eyes were red at this time I don't know I think I woke up late on this day well, I might have got done working out. I don't know what I did this day, actually. I just knew I did something. I was really tired. And I went to the store to go get some mouthwash. Or toothpaste. Whichever comes first. But that's how the story ended. I went to my car and shocked. I was like, that's the first time I asked if I got weed. You know what the crazy thing about this is? I'm 23, about to be 24, right? I ain't never smoked before. I ain't never drunk a sip of alcohol. I could buy the thing. And I don't sell the stuff. I got people that are younger than me asking me to buy the stuff for them. One, two times I bought some swishes and some alcohol. That's the only thing I bought for somebody. On two occasions. That is the story of the time that I got accused of selling marijuana. Now, I told this to somebody and it was like, that could have been the undercover cop. Well, that undercover cop did not do a good job. How you gonna run him to you? The man was black too. Did I forgot to mention that he was black. You don't do this to your own brother. Unless he was really needing something, cause he's probably stressed out. For real, like stressed out, stressed out. <laughs> no Kendrick Lamar. But that is the story of the time that I got accused of selling marijuana. You want more story time? And you want more content? You know what to do. Hit that subscribe button. And make sure your notifications on. I'm about to start dropping stuff. Until next time. I'll see you in the next video. And another thing. If you're smoking or drinking. There's other addictions you can do besides drugs. Like listening to music. Going to the movies. Doing hobbies like collecting. Collecting stuff. But not don't do drugs. Say no to drugs, kids. If you're a kid and you want you to say no to drugs. If you're older than me, the same age as me, stop it. You're about to die of a heart attack and about to die from lung cancer. But I'll see y'all in the next video.